Hello everyone, my name is Jurgen. I run the 11 foot 8 website and we're here at the bridge, the 11 foot 8 bridge in Durham, North Carolina on Gregson Street. For 11 years and almost 8 months I've been documenting the crashes here at this bridge. Uh, the crashes of overheight vehicles that hit the, this low bridge and today is October 26, uh, 2019 and uh, they're in the process of raising this bridge so it's a bit of an era that comes to end and I'm here to give you guys one last tour of the old can opener before a new era starts with the 12 foot 4 new rebooted can opener Let's walk over to the bridge and see what they're up to over there. So you can maybe you can see that they've already taken off part of the structure underneath the trestle here. Go closer you can see the pieces on the ground here. So yeah they've taken part of the structure apart, cut it off. You can see up here, cut off big parts of the old structure. A lot of work, a lot of old steel they had to cut off in order to prepare the structure for raising it. spoke uh, to one of the supervisors here at the construction site at the 11 foot 8 bridge and um, he told me that the work that's currently going on is basically cleanup work they're getting rid of a bunch of unused parts of the bridge um, like the old um, walkway rem remnants that are no longer useful so they're cutting all that unused steel off and cleaning up the trestle structure in general to get it ready for the raising um, next Tuesday actually and uh, so all Tuesday they're going to be working on raising the structure 8 inches to get it basically even with the the grade of the uh, level crossing block up the road at Duke Street and uh, once that is done they're going to spend a few more days um, sandblasting and painting the structure, give it a new paint job, make it look nice and uh, hopefully it'll be safer and uh, a little more attractive for the neighborhood. So they've cut off most of the bolts of the crash beam and here's one of those bad boys still hot i have to be careful I have to burn my fingers but yeah they cut cut off most of the bolts now and uh, they're making a plan for getting the crash beam down so a uh, train just passed and they moved the crane across the trestle Catch the crash beam and they are working on removing the last couple of bolts now that hold the crash beam in place so they, they can remove the beam 
and lift it down. So that's it for today from the 11 foot 8 construction site. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have more updates in the next few days 